So peeps, and welcome back. I have to welcome me back, I guess. It's always been a long time when I make videos. Uh, this kind of time for me is allowing me to do more thinking of doing videos. So we're going to start off with a cool roguelike game called Nuclear Throne, which has been played by a couple of people that I enjoy watching, and uh, I kind of want to play it myself. Uh, I've turned off the music right now just for any potential copyright issues, as you per know. And uh, the first thing I'm about to do is say there's a lot of classes, a lot of cool stuff. Uh, the first one I'm going to play as, obviously, is the chicken. Uh, that's got some cool moves, cool abilities. And uh, you're going to kind of see what the chicken gets to do. Uh, we can kind of walk around here, grab this uh, radiation. And uh, the chicken special ability, as you see here, is I can slow down time. And, uh, of course, as a melee weapon as good for, is knocking away enemy poor projectiles. Ah! Okay, that thing opened up when I wasn't expecting it. That's kind of bad of me. Then we get to do mutations. If you level up up here at the top left, uh, I get to pick a mutation. As this is called Nuclear Throne for a reason, uh, there's not a whole lot of good stuff here. With, mu uh, with melee, I like corpses flying at art. There's a negative to it, though. Uh, when enemies drop, experience screwdriver game. Don't make me laugh. It's a weapon that's a melee that has this much of a range. It attacks quickly, but it's it's not it's not very good. Uh, so you can carry two weapons with you. Those red chests there are a weapon chest that you can pick from. However, um, you can choose to not take them in the hopes of getting a super weapon chest, uh, which could be very beneficial. Uh, but uh -huh, I was about to say that I was going to open it, uh, but I don't need to do that now because I got another weapon. So now I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait for a super uh, weapon chest, which will be to my benefits later in the game. Die. 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 All right, there we go. Problems are relatively averted at this point. Now, there's some enemies that you can touch, uh, some enemies that you can't. It really depends on whether or not they are kind of those kinds of melee characters. Uh, I'm just going to leave Big Bandit down there. Uh, he's kind of one of the bosses of the early game. He comes at about level 2. Uh, and he pops his way in. He can break down walls. And uh, I'm hurting, kind of slowing my own shots down by... Uh, oh, I'm clicking off screen there. That's not good. Uh, I kind of slow down my own shots when I do this thing. So it slows down my rate of fire just as well as theirs. But I can get a mutation that allows me to fire at the same speed. I didn't want to lose all of that lovely radiation experience. Uh, so that's that's not a super weapon chest, sadly. Uh, there's a weapon over here. What is it? Slugger? Uh, I'm going to keep the machine gun. Having some rapid fire. Uh, another slugger. Good joke, game. Good joke. Now, as you saw there, I can actually melee away his shots away from me if I ever need to, which is why a melee weapon with high rate of fire is very good. Uh, but, of course, if you're only that, it's not going to be very good for you. Luckily, I got some health back there, which is really good. Uh, oh, scarier fa Ah, back muscle. Yeah, I really need to take it. That is, like, one of the most important mutations that you can ever get in uh, this game. I really, really can't stress the importance ninjas must die. Oh, God. Okay, that's poison. I, I don't want to mess with that. Uh, yeah, ninjas with the sticks there, they kind of sit there and they act like they're not alive. And that I can't tell that they're alive, which sometimes I can't. And they, ah! No! Get away from me! Oh, oh I got a med kit. Oh. As you all saw there me demonstrating, uh, I have a secondary ability with chicken. Uh, if I... Oh man, this is horrible. Shotgun, turtle thing, not turtle, you're like an alligator. You need to get away from me, please. Thank you. Uh, shotgun's messy in the face. Uh, but these guys, uh, my second ability is uh, the ability to come back alive after dying, which is really good. Uh, if I... I stay alive as the chicken with my head cut off <laughs> for a little bit, and uh, I can have the opportunity... Damn it, I can't escape there. Oh well. I get the opportunity to come back alive if I pick up a med kit before I really die. <laughs> uh, hammerhead, not very good. Uh, Eagle Eyes can be good with some of the later weapons, but Rhino Skin, 4 max HP, very nice, especially when you take random stupid damage or builds up over time. Or those guys with a stick try to one-shot you because they deal lots of damage and they're fast and really hard to hit sometimes. 
Uh, they're relatively easy to kill, as you can see him running around up there. He's probably gonna make it down here to me. Oh my god. That guy needs to stop freaking out. Thank you. Uh, oh, that's the thing that breathes fire. No, oh, fire is dangerous. Okay, that worked. Thank you. Go away. Just eat your own stuff. Oh, a crossbow. Oh, yeah. I'm going with that. Time to one-shot people in the face. This is just... Crisis 3 all over. Okay, game. I need a super weapon chest. I mean, I might have missed it on one of the previous ones, but that's not my fault. And that car's gonna blow up. Yeah, that, that hurt. Unless something else hurt me. I'm not entirely certain, actually. Ah! Uh, birds must die. Uh, so we have ammo. Okay, this is about to become... Here's the bullet hell part of this game. Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, he got me. My rate of fire wasn't that great. <laughs> So, as you can see, that's how far I made it in the total length of this game. Um, it's got a very Binding of Isaac-esque feel. Of, there's certain levels with different sorts of uh, feel to them and difficulty. And I just didn't I just didn't get very many good weapons. And my play wasn't exactly the best. I, I'll, I'll admit it. Uh, my play just wasn't doing the best I've ever had. And honestly, I haven't beaten this game. Okay. I haven't beaten this game yet. Uh, I haven't making, I haven't made it to the nuclear throne. My ass has not sat upon the grand throne that I so deserve. Uh, sadly. Obviously, I don't deserve it then. Evolution is not in my favor. I wish it was. Hey! Asshole scorpions. These guys are just like... Uh, slugger. Yeah, I'll take it this time. It's actually a very good weapon early game here. It's got some high uh, power smacks like that. It's a shotgun. So you use your shells. And you can see up there that I have different types of ammo, and uh, how much ammo I have in different stuff. Oh man, avoided damage. Okay, I don't know if there's anything back there, but it uh, doesn't matter. Ooh, what to go with on these ones? Ah, uh, uh, plutonium hunger is actually really good to avoid losing experience in the future. Uh, and to get other, like, med packs and stuff, especially as chicken, that's really important. Okay, you need to die. Thank you. And, uh, Big Bandit's gonna be here any second. <clears throat> he's gonna make me cry a little bit. Or maybe is that not yet? No, that's on level 3, maybe. Yeah, that's level 3. I misspoke before. That is definitely level 3. And die, and die, and go away. Thank you. Perfect. Alright, so that gun's gonna come with us. Uh, if a gun is sitting inside that portal, it flies with you. Uh, so I could take it if I really wanted to, which I am not going to at the moment, because this weapon is good enough by itself for now. I'm just gonna stay slow here, just so I can kind of deal with some of the nonsense, and the fact that Big Bandit's here. Now, he's not that hard. You, you kind of have this feeling of how to deal with enemies in this game, and he just points in one direction and shoots. Uh, if you get too close to him, though, he's gonna fuck you up pretty hard. Um, uh, always, you can hide behind stuff. It's out in the open that he's a real problem, because he shoots at you constantly. Uh, if you get too close to him, though, he will melee your face off, and you'll be surprised at how fast he can move. Alright, so here he's coming. Uh, triple machine gun. Ah! That worked. Now, it's really wasteful, but if you get, like, better accuracy, or you get right in their face, you just destroy people. Oh man, I thought I was going to take damage there. Maybe I did, and I just didn't see. That is always possible. Uh, but you never know. I like triple machine guns, simply because they're pretty hilarious. And you can just wreck things like that. <laughs> oh, pop gun. That's not a bad one. It's, you know, not. it's really not efficient at all. Uh, scarier face, yes. Uh, oh, I got two level ups. Ooh, racing mind. Yes, please. Uh, so basically, every time I get a kill, I automatically reload. Because there is reloading in this game, it just happens automatically. Uh, and as holding these sorts of weapons, that's really nice, because BAM! I can just attack immediately after getting a kill, which is nice, especially with melee, because that means I can immediately attack. Uh, and like I said, rate of fire is relatively very important in this game. Ah! That shotgun guy, you you need to stop the nonsense. I'm... okay. Alright, so this is Nuclear Throne. Oh, I randomly managed to get a medical kit. My god. Thank you, Plutonium Hunger, for, like, saving me there. Uh, that definitely would not have happened if I didn't have Plutonium Hunger. I would not have been anywhere near close enough. Alright, so I'm gonna take a risk and Toxic Launcher. 
Uh, that's gonna take explosives? I want to see if I can do something here. There's there's a secret that you perhaps don't know that exists in this game. That's a shotgun. Um, there is a place that you can go that I find absolutely hilarious. No, it's not here. Okay, so that's not happening. Hey. Yeah, this shoots those. Yeah. Now, nah, that'll kill me. <laughs> Uh, if I've learned one thing about this game is I die from stupid damage and I die from damage I inflict upon myself most of the time. Alright, so the chicken ninja katana is not doing the best anymore. I wish I got an upgrade like the wrench or something. Uh, that would have been a lot nicer. Oh man, thank god those things die in one hit with a scarier face. Uh, otherwise I'd be a sad panda. Uh, luckily, we have this area kind of blocked off and I can just kind of beat the crap out of these guys. Gotta be careful, those cars explode. Ah, oh, sniper! Uh, I can actually destroy that fire too, by the way. Uh, or at least, you know, cut some of it away. It's just like any other projectile. Alright, I'm gonna get a little risky here, and that was kind of a bad idea. Sup, sniper? Oh god, I clicked off the screen. I apologize. Uh... Come on, sniper, shoot at me. I want you to. Make me hurt. There we go. I'll bounce all your shots back to you. This is the nice thing about... It's like kind of easy mode, but not really. Because the you still can't avoid... You're still going slow. So you can't really avoid unavoidable damage. Um, do I want to? No, I'll skip it for now. Uh, if I can manage to get something good, you guys explode, and I don't like that. That is not my life. Thank you. Explosions are really, really scary in this game. All right, you guys need to stop the nonsense. I've got back to full health. Never mind. I'm at four health now. <laughs> I just took a bunch of shots to the face. Um, melee range is really good. Uh, boiling veins is relatively good. I enjoy bloody lust. Simply because it gets me back my health, but in the late game, maybe not help me. I'm going to take melee range, simply because it's really nice. Ah, that guy explodes. Not cool, man. Now, I would love, love to get a... Okay, game. Seriously, stop pausing on me. Don't get that crazy. <clears throat> there we go. That's out of the way. Back out of here. Luckily, I didn't blow those cars up, because that would have made me very sad and depressed. And there we go. Kind of kill those guys. Perfect. Moving on. Yeah. Whoa. What? Are you guys just killing each other down here? Okay. Nope. That's going to stop. This all just needs to stop. Thank you. That, that, that ninja was hiding. Oh, health. Thank you. Okay. I'm out of ammo there. Yeah, that's lovely. I definitely wanted to be out of ammo. Oh! Alright. That that thing there scares me. Because I don't want to deal with that nonsense. Energy sword! Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Woo! Uh, there's that upgrade I was looking for. One shot. Good thing I got that melee upgrade. I'm loving this now. Um, you're dead. Thank you. Alright, there. Alright! Damn explosions. Those cars. So, okay, this is really open. Just gonna clear some of it. Oh, yeah, that's that's the boss. Yep, that's Big Dog. Hi, Big Dog. And, um, you wouldn't mind like not doing that thing that you do when you hurt people like me. At All right, you you need to kill yourself now. Thank you. Okay, he explodes and hurts you. There's lots of explosions in this game. If you haven't been able to tell yet, uh, laser pistol. Um, ooh, man, this is tough decisions. What's this? Flame shotgun? Yeah, 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 Okay, I got sucked in. That's fine. Oh, thank you. Thank you, back muscle. Uh, that's necessary for winning the game, if I haven't demonstrated that yet. There we go. Got some of my health back before I died from not using the energy sword, which I thought I had equipped, uh, which would make me sad. I've... Now, I've made it past this level before, but it, it's this level is tough because of one reason, and one reason, those crystals, and they're not, okay, well, I, I know nothing in the ways of anything, I just died, <laughs> oh man, that, that, that happened, that, yeah, okay, well, 
I'm gonna try a different character here, because I need to, like, actually showcase. I'm gonna go with, uh, let's go with Crystal, or maybe I'll start from the left and go to the right. Fish! Uh, I don't like playing as Fish. Uh, his secondary ability lets you roll, which you basically just move in one cardinal, whatever direction you're pointing, faster, and, uh, ooh, is that a crossbow? Yeah, it is! Woo! Man, I'm so used to slowing down time right now. I need to readjust my nonsense. Levels. Uh, yeah, by the way, if you whatever weapon you have when you pick up those ammo chests, uh, they will give you the type of ammo of the weapon you have. If you do melee, it gives you random, which is not fun. Hey, right, there's some ammo there. Gave me some bullets. Kind of nice if I get a better bullet weapon later. Uh, I enjoy using the crossbow for one of the main reasons. Oh, God. Need to readjust, readjust, readjust. I don't have melee. Stop trying to get so close to all the enemies. Oh, laser pistol. Yes, please. Laser weapons this wet early is very good. Uh, very good indeed. Okay, you just need to die. Thank you. Okay, you're not going to explode or go over me. Uh, slugger. Ye no, laser. Better, in my opinion. I don't have much ammo, which is why it's in wrench. Hi, wrench. I'm happy you're here. I'm really happy. I'm excited you're here because I like melee in this game. It's really fun, which is why I like chicken. Uh, as you can see there, the wrench is like far superior to the chicken weapon sword thing, which you'd think wouldn't be the case, but it is. Uh, crossbow is also really good for one-shotting uh, enemies. Uh, later, it doesn't. Like um, the first enemy, I think it doesn't do that to. Is the big bandit. Uh, he's kind of like a mini-boss, though, so that would be expected. Scarier face makes Wrench a uh, plausible thing later. Oh, no, I don't want to take that. It's not that good. It may I can infinitely go around and shoot while using that ability. I have a laser brain, which means I do better weapon damage with lasers, which I forgot that I left back in the first level. Let's forget I didn't pick that mutation and go upon our lives with the idea that we can now basically do a ton of damage to enemies. Ah, and that's a maggot. Uh, with our lovely melee weapon. Ah, that I can't slow down time. But, uh, doesn't matter because... Have loveliness involved. There we go. Thank you, maggot. You kind of need to die. Ah, you don't need to go through there, man. I, I understand your plight. Ow. Okay, well, fine then. Be that way. I didn't want to have your happiness. There we go. Moving on. Didn't get a level up there, which kind of sucks. But, um, let's, let's just... Now, nah, okay, yeah, yeah, that's a thing. Really? There we go, that's what I wanted. Alright, this nonsense just, just has to end. I'm, I'm just beating them all up. Melee weapon for the win. Thank you. Rats, you, you can die. You were, like, one of the bigger banes of my existence. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, ah. Oh. Speaking of banes of my existence, random damage. Uh, not the best thing ever. Yeah, there's poison there. Haha, -ha, rat, you died. I'm gonna get your experience for nothing. I actually, I don't think I did damage to him. How did I one shot that guy? Was I just like critted him or something? I don't even know that's a thing in this game. That would be amazing. I... Okay. Yep, that happened. All right, so uh, there's two characters. Uh, I'll probably show another character later on at some other points, uh, but that that's kind of how it goes. This game is short, you know, each run's very quick, addictive, fun to play. Um, the characters are very easy to get, almost simply just playing it once will get you most of the characters, uh, except for a couple of them. Uh, so there's a lot of stuff to look forward to, so I ho hope you enjoyed that, and I will see you later! Come on, just die, take him out with rockets.